Blade and Sorcery is mostly known for its sandbox mode, mainly because there isn't much more so far, but there is one game mode I honestly never tried, but I bet some of you forgot that it even exists. First things first though, let's hear from our sponsors. That's right, nobody sponsors my videos except me. <laughs> nah, for real now. I don't really have that much free time for videos, so it means a ton if you guys like and subscribe. Thank you so much. Survival is a fun mode that tests your skills and stamina. It's simple. If you want, you can equip any weapon, select arena, switch from sandbox to survival, and click travel. Upon arrival, you'll be met with three stone pillars with three random weapons floating above. Choose one to begin the wave and fight for your life. Once you finish a wave, pillars raise back up, then you choose another random weapon and start another wave. Now that we've got through the board, stuff let's see some fighting not knowing what to expect i was pretty happy the game gave me this overpowered weapon but i quickly realized that it'll get old very fast so i changed my strategy and started switching weapons I wanted to record my mic during playing, but since my girlfriend was watching a reality TV show right next to me, I'll spare myself the copyright claim. Each wave gives you different enemies. Sometimes it's a mix of melee and range, sometimes only melee, which makes it more interesting and doesn't bore you right away. My plan going into this was to flex my almost 200 hours in the game by getting very far, but I very quickly realized that my physique isn't the best for getting farther than 10 waves without any longer breaks while avoiding overheating and passing out in the middle of our living room. So here's my proposal. If this video reaches 100 likes, I will stream myself trying to get as far as humanly possible. While you guys can decide on what weapons I can use and so on. And I'll make a video from it as well. Around wave 8, I had sweat exiting my entire body at copious amounts and I was hoping the end was near. When I finally reached wave 10, I was just so hot, not like look-wise, I probably looked like I just took a shower, but I fall through and finally reached the end.
And there we go. I made it to wave 10. Super excited and really. Please subscribe to help me reach 10k before the year ends. I hope you enjoyed this video. Leave a like if you did. And I'll see you in the next one.